alleviating low battery anxiety of mobile users via low power video streaming. Patching Laboratory Season, season China. Abstract The per pervasive low battery anxiety ABA among modern mo mobile users has caused a negative impact on users' emotion and health. And such anxiety may directly lead to loss of cost cost customers in power hungry applications. For example, video streaming, despite its importance, ABA has not been thoroughly investigated due to the difficulty in quantitatively measured ABA. To fill, this, fill the gap, we present a quantitative model to measure the ABA among mobile users and design a tailored mechanism to alleviate it via display energy saving in video streaming. In specific, we first conduct a large-scale user survey among 2,000 plus mobile users and strategy extract an empirical ABA model that captures the variation of users' anxiety degree along with the uh, battery power draining. Then to exploit the emerging edge computing paradigm, we propose LPVS, a novel solution for low power video streaming service at the network edge. It aims to minimize the ABA of mobile users by integrating the extract ABA models with the energy saving image video content transforming techniques. The emulation emulation Result using real-world video watching traces demonstrated that LPVS can effectively elevate mobile users, LBA, and prolong the low battery users' video watching time. For example, customer retention by 39%. Introduction background. Have you ever worried about battery power before your smartphone dies? Have you ever uh, unwillingly given given on watching a video just because of the low battery status of the smartphone? If your answer is yes, then most probably you are suffering from the low battery anxiety, ABA. For example, the fear of losing, losing mobile phone's battery power, especially when the battery, power, battery level is low, say below 20%. Believe it or not, 90% of mobile users show the ABA symptoms, according to the LG survey 2016. Worse still, based on our survey, over 2,000 plus mobile users in 19, 2019, the ratio of ABA suffering reaches 91.88%. Evidence have shown that ABA can bring widest impact on the behavior of us mobile users. According to our survey, over 20% of the mobile audience will drop video watching when the battery life remains 20% and then dropping rate quickly. quickly. This work is supported by the National Natural Science Foundation of China. Figure 1. Energy consumption of different hardware components of smartphones during video playback. Data for LCD smartphones is from 9, and data for OLED smartphone is estimated by comparing the power consumption of OLED and that of LCDs. Rises to 50% when only 10% battery energy left. left. This suggests that saving mobile phone energy and energy and prolonged each working time cannot only relieve the suffering of LBA but also helps customer retention in mobile video streaming services. For this purpose, we need to conduct investigative LBA and treat it as an important quality of service QoE metric. By looking into the power consumption splitting of the mobile platform during video streaming, we have found that the display module is primarily energy closure. As illustrated in Figure 1 LCD and OLED, the mainstream for smartphone displays consumes a much higher energy than other components during the video playback. Although a great deal of efforts have been devoted to saving energy of major components of mobile phones, for example CPU 2nd and 3rd, and communication module 4th and 5th, the energy consumption of the display has uh, attracted relatively less attention. Pushed by the relative recent industrial development, the percentage of energy consumption in displays may become even higher. First, with continuous hard hardware upgrade, both the size and resolution of mobile displays are increasing, six, making the display more power hungry. Second, 5G communication and edge computing, 7th and 8th, are 
around the corners. Together, they promised the mobile users users much improved experience of HD, 4K, and 5K video watching with faster speed, more stable connection, and low latency than those of 4G networks. This in turn will further boom the already popular mobile video stream, streaming services and lead to a much increased power consumption of displays. Opportunities. It has been found that different multimedia content represented by RGB pixel values have quite different power di dissipation on display to be for more details. This observation directly leads to design of power efficiency image video playing schemes using content transforming method with video streaming. A great portion of energy can be saved with negligible video quality distortion for human perception 11 and 12, while the image and video transforming can save display energy in, in in-course extra CPU and GPU computation cost it performed on mobile devices 11 and 12. Specifically, the transforming is operated on a per pixel basis and thus uh, computation intensive, especially for high resolution display. In consequence, the expected energy saving on mobile devices can be offset or even uh, negated. The emerging edge computing paradigm is an efficient way to interact with mobile devices at the network edge. 13. By providing time-sensitive mobile service with computation, storage and bandwidth resources close to the other end users. Compared to remote cloud, edge computing is obviously a better choice for performing video performance since first video transforming depends on users' device types. For example, backlight scaling for LCD and color transforming for OLED. And second, Edge Server is most much closer to mobile users. By leveraging Edge computing for video transforming, we can save the display energy of a mobile device without the transforming overhead. We name such a refined service low power video streaming APVS, which could be provided as a as a value-added service by the mobile service provider. Challenges. The, there are two major challenges in the APVS design. First, precisely quantifying the low battery anxiety of mobile users is different and currently has no readily available reference. As the anxiety of mobile users belongs to one of the human feelings of emo or emotions, it is not easy to measure with uh, some existing metric, nor optimize as we wish it. Thus, without referred ABA metrics, how can we measure and model the low battery anxiety of mobile users in a quantitative way? Second, due to limited computation resources at the edge environment, the video streaming provider may not be able to Second, due to limited computation resources at the edge environment, the video streaming provider may not be able to serve or or but part of the audience with video transforming, taking the Nokia Airframe OpenHD server 14, for example, and then referring to the test transcoding cost. 15. On the edge server can only process video streaming for about 100 mobile devices simultaneously. Hence, under the resources constraint, how can we choose choose the best subset of users to reduce the, their ABA. To be specific, at most Apple. probable transforming contributions. Addressing the above challenges, this is the first paper is synthetically and quantitatively in investigate the problem of elevating ABA of mobile users. The innovator is to use ABA as a critical performance metric to guide video transforming at the edge. This paper includes the following, following contributions. We conduct a large-scale survey over 2,000 mobile users on low, low battery anxiety to model the quantitative relationship between the mobile user's anxiety degree and the, and the mobile device battery status. This survey and corresponding empirical con conclusions providing strong real-world evidence on the importance of this work. 
By incorporating the extract quantitative model of LBA, we propose a new solution tailored or for low power video streaming named LPVS, in which we explicitly deficit the scenario and systematically model the energy saving and anxiety reduction by joint optimizing problems. By analyzing the hardness of the optimizing problem, we further develop a two-phase heuristic method to serve the survey using info information, competing and Bayesian inf inference. We develop the APVS emulator and we use, use a real-world Twitch, Twitch dataset to evaluate the performance of APVS. It, extensive emulation results demonstrate that the, with LPVS, the overall mobile users can save their devices energy up to 37%, thus much reducing the LP, LBA of mobile users, and thus low battery user can prolong their video watching time by 39%. Background and related work, background of low battery anxiety. The anxiety Causes by the low battery power of handheld devices has been noticed for a long time. It was initially investigated under the under the cover of nomophobia, which refers to the fear of being without a smartphone. In 2016, the low battery anxiety was formally proposed mainly owning to an LG survey among 2,000 smartphone users in the U.S. The survey found that 90% of the mobile users would feel pan panic when their phone battery drops to 20% or lower. Since the lower battery anxiety, i.e. ABA, has been widely known to the public, ABA can bring widely and deeply negative impact on mobile users' lives. According to the LG survey, one in the three people are likely to skip the gym. When it comes to choosing between hitting the gym and charging the smartphone, furthermore, for those su severely suffering from the ABA, it can cause stra strange behaviors. For example, head home immediately, ask chargers from strangers, or secretly borrow, borrow other chargers. To be, be, to be even worse, ABA is becoming a ma the major trigger of nomophobia which is commonly treated as one type of mental, mental health problems. Although ABA has shown negative effect upon mobile users, emotion, behavior, and even health, it has been investigated thoroughly. To be specific, there is no period work measure and quantifying ABA in the quantitative way, which is one, the, one of the major tasks in this work. Background of display power saving. Modern smartphones are typically equipped with one of the dis two display types, liquid crystal displays, LCD or, or, or organic light emitted diode, or LED display, organic light emitted diode, diode displays. The, the two types of display work differently ha and have quite different power consumption characteristics. Review of the state-of-the-art power saving stretches for LCD and OLED respectively. Power saving for LCD. The major power consumption of LCD is backlight, which eliminates illuminate the liquid crystal of display with various brightness levels. If power consumption can quiet different at different brightness levels, thus by strategically strategy, strategy scaling the backlight and regulating, regulating the image illuminance. The original image display by LCD can be rendered with much less energy and distortion negligible and tolerable for human perception. 11. Accordingly, a broad, broad spectrum of schemes based on backlight scaling with illumin luminance compensation have been proposed to cut down the power consumption of LCD, power, sa power saving of OLED. Compared, compared to LCD, the OLED display is not only thinner and lighter, but also can support up to three orders of magnitude, magnitude higher refresh rate, 16. For the OLED display, dis different RGB color subpixels generate light with different energy efficiencies. The blue pixels consumes about twice the power of the green ones, while the red in between one of the two. 17. Does the power consumption much relies on the display colors? 
rather than brightness. Uh, on the other hand, the human visual system, HVS, has greater perception flex flexibility, thus can tolerate uh, small color changes. 17. Accordingly, various color transforming schemes have been de developed for saving energies of OLED displays. We summarize existing strategies for display power saving in Table 1. For the LCD and OLED displays, respectively, level these strategies are fixed and wise. For example, uh, they they operate on a For example, the they operate on a pixel per pixel basis, which incurs a non-negligible overhead for mobile devices, especially those with high resolution displays, 11 and 12. Set up for video transforming and over 40% of the energy saving was archived, achieved. A similar idea was uh, applied in the work of 26, where the adoption of video transforming was shifted from the raw power device to a prox proxy middleware. In both work, the proxy server is a testing platform designed for one dedicated client device, which is different from our scenario when the uh, Video streaming service is provided for a group of users. Above all, neither of them takes the user's low battery anxiety into consideration, which is another major difference from our work. ABA survey and modeling, data collection, A data collection, to run the impact of the low battery anxiety and establish a quantitative model. We carefully designed on online survey referred to 27 27th for the detailed questionnaire and continuously collected answer from the mobile users for over three months. At the end, the, we collected 2,032 effective answers after data cleansing. Refer to Table 2 in the appendix, appendix for detailed information regarding the participant. Based on the survey data, it is surprising that 91.88%, 1,867 out of 2,032, of the participants are suffering from the low battery anxiety, more or less. This is consistent, consistent with the LG survey, but the percentage is even higher in our survey. It is also interesting to see that nearly half of the mobile users will give up watching an attractive video. Once the battery level of mobile phone drops below 10%, these findings provide direct and strong support to necessary of our work. ABA curve extraction. In our laboratory designed questionnaire, questionnaire, one question the participant needs to answer is at what battery level in percentage from 0 to 100 will you charge your mobile phone when it is possible? The answer provides us with an angle to infer at energy level a user normally begins to worry about the battery life, for example, experience the low battery anxiety, then, the, then with all the collective, collected answers, we are able to extract the ABA curve model, the anxiety degree caused by the draining of battery power versus the battery energy status. Specifically, a four-step procedure is conducted to obtain the ABA curve from the low, rate, low data, initialize 100 m empty beans, indicating the battery levels almost from almost empty to free for example 1 to 100 to second for each answer for each for example integer 1 1 to 100 add 1 to bin conduct for the all answers and obtain declining discrete curve in the region of 1 to 10 of 100 normalize normalize cumulative numbers to region of 1 that 1 comma 1 0 comma 1 denoted the anxiety degree we obtained the aba curve anxiety anxiety degree versus better level a similar approaches also was also adopted in 28 to identify the commonly used used the responsible time threshold for service level objectives in cloud service. Following the ob observe above extraction pro process, the resulting ABA curves from the survey, the 2032 users is shown in figure two. From the illustrated ABA curve, we can observe that the anxiety degree does not linearly increase with the decrease of the energy level. 
if we use a linear function, linear function, figure two, extract anxiety curve from the survey data 2013 to mobile users. The straight dash is right in figure two. As a comparison, user's anxiety is a convex function of the energy level when when the energy level is 20% to, to 100% but is concave when the energy level drops in 1-20%. A sharp increase of anxiety can be observed, observed when the energy level drops in 20%. This is most probably caused, uh, caused by the color change of battery icon. For example, the icon's face color changes to yellow or red, and the low battery warning, warning message inside on LBA elevation. The non literally of the LBA curve indicates that the users sensitive to the power draining at the different battery levels is heterogeneous. This also implies that with choosing a subset of, of mobile users for anxiety minimizing, following a random user's select, selection, strategy cannot be optimal, as those are currently not sensitive to the energy status may select it as resulting in less performance gain. Instead, the mobile users that, that are sensitive to a battery power draining, for example, those near sharp increase are area in figure 2 should be given a high priority. High priority. This is also how to optimize scheme will take effect. Note the note that the extract ABA curves have was obtained with survey questions with assumption that participant or answers truthfully reflected reflect their feelings and behaviors. This assumption may be challenged, and the alternative method to avoid this pitfall to is to look into users real behavior 29 and 13, which we live uh, as our future work. LPVS, low power video streaming, scenario of, overview. As is illustrated by figure 3, we assume that uh, assume the 5G, 5G mobile edge computing MEC platform consisting of 5G based stations, edge servers, and CDN servers, where the 5G based stations and edge servers are deployed at location close to the uh, to, to end users and the CDN servers are located at the CDN point of presence of POP. There is a content delivery strategy between the edge servers and content servers 32 and 30, 31 and 32, which, which may prefetch, prefetch a certain, certain amount of uh, video content from the CDN servers to the edge server based on the historical videos request from the mobile users. This content prefetch strategy provides underlying support for and is independent LPVS. We assume that all the mobile devices within one, one region. For example, the cover area of the base station from the virtual cluster VC where they, are, they, are, they share the same edge server. Without loss generically assume that one BC virtual cluster, virtual cluster, virtual cluster host and mobile devices. We divided the time into a stretch of equal length, five minutes intervals in the implementation as per remark one. APVS needs to make a new scheduling decision for video streaming transforming at the beginning of each time slot. Scheduling points in figure 4. Usually complete video is split into, into a number of small chunks, but depending on different caching strategies, 32, the edge server might not have ho the whole video chunks and the number of available video chunks may vary. vary. For the video, M assumes that the current available number of video chunks at the scheduling point KM, with the above notation, we denoted the video chunks played on devices N in the in the time slot T by the DN T one upper N T with DN T, in which VID VID in which VID stands for the video ID CIDIs to 
1 to km for the IDs of video chunks available for device and at the beginning of time slot t. Overall, at this scheduling point, LPVS should make decisions on whether or not the edge server should perform video transforming for certain users in the VC to save display power and alleviate, alleviate, alleviate their low, low battery anxiety. Remarks 1. We we ignore the scenario where a user switches videos during the time slot. This omission is due to the periodical scheduling used LPVS. The interval time should be should not be too small in second to avoid to avoid unnecessary computation overhead at the edge server. The empirical value of five minutes is used based on the fact that first battery level should not drop too much during the time and then second can tolerate a certain level of anxiety when battery level does not drop too much. If a user switches videos during one time slot, MPVS will keep the same decision. We, I will uh, without video transforming for this user until next scheduling point. Models for power consumption in video streaming. When the device when a device plays a video power is uh, power rate may fluctuate up to up and down around the played chunks due to different brightness level for the LCD of different color con distributions. F figure 4 illustrates of power rate estimating with the available video chunks for three users' mobile devices. For the OLED, when playing on video M, we den denoted the power rate on the N's device for the case chunks by PNM K1. Note that given the display specification, for example, type size, size resolution and the available video chunks K, corresponding power rate PNM K, can be estimated with the existing power models for LCD 20 or OLED 17. Also notice that with the one time slot, the request video chunks may, may be may be not all available due to different prefetching and buffering strategies as illustrated for two and two end user three in figure four under the, under such a situation we only use available video chunks for the estimation of pnmk by applying the video transforming given in second on the video dt dt the power reduction ratio of the specific device and during the time slot t can be represented R and D and T R for simplicity. Where zero R and T remarked about R and the parameter represent an average power saving saving ratio on device and achieved achieved over a bunch of video chunks chunks during one time throw. Thus, it is not fixed value and can only run after playing, playing the transformed video. We treated it as a random variable and update each value with the Bayesian inference. But in the following part of modeling, we assume that we have already run the knowledge of Rn. At the beginning of the arbitrary time slot t due to limited edge server capacity, LPVS may only choose the subset of request video for transforming. We denoted the decision variable of whether to perform, perform video transforming for the end devices during the entire time slot by Xn with Xn equal 1, indicating yes and Xn equal 0. Otherwise, does one time for the time slot t, we have Xn. 0, 0,1 upper n by by determining the value of x n and referring to the knowledge of p n m and the k and r n we are able to infer the power rate of device n when playing the case chunks only or chunks of video m by
مودر فور انرژی استیتاس شی مودر فور انرژی استیتاس ان رو بیتر انجایتی آنادر آنادر امپورتنت انفورمیشن این ای پی بی اس ایز ا استیت این دا انرژی استیتاس اف موبایل دیوایس میجر دا میجر بای دا میجر بای دا ریمینینگ انرژی اف بیتری وی دو نوت هیر دا انرژی استیتاس اف دا انس دیوایس ات دا بیگینینگ اف ان اربیتری تایم سلوپ بای ای ان ام وير ام اند كي ار فيديو اي دي اند فيديو تشانس اي دي ريسبكتيفلي ريكوست باي ذا انس ديفايس بيفور ذا اتش سوبر ديتيرمينز تو ترانسفورم ترانسفورم فيديو تشانس ريكوست باي ذا ديفايس اند ذا ديفايس شود هاف سفيشنت انرجي تو باور ديفايس اذروايز ذا ترانسفورم هاز نو مينينغ هانس ذا فالوينغ ان ايكواليتي شود هولد E N N K or where delta denotes delta K denotes the time length of current video chance. Thus, when X N, for example, the video chance requested by the device and are not transformed, the above inequality takes no effective effect. Always holds as E N M is non negative. Meanwhile, meanwhile with the power rate of the device and when When playing the case chance of the video M given by K in three, the energy status of the device before playing the next video chance K plus one can be predicted by E and M K plus one E and M minus pi and M K delta K. As you mentioned, over 90% of the mobile users are suffering from the low battery anxiety. First, the figure is 91%, 91.88% in our survey. Usually, the less the energy, battery, battery energy, the higher anxiety. Such a relationship between the battery energy status and the low battery anxiety have been captured by the anxiety curves shown in Figure 2. We use, we use pi. To denote the empirical function, reflect the anxiety degree of the user given in, given the energy status of this device. To be to be specific, for device N with the energy status of E N M K, the anxiety anxiety degree degree of each owner can be estimated by pi E N M K, as illustrated in figure by figure two. The anxiety degree of the user between 0 and 1, with the anxiety status of her, her mobile device between 100% and 0 correspondingly. As, we, as have been reported, low battery anxiety can pot potentially have a negative effect on users' video watching behavior, behavior 3A. Thus, we believe that reducing users' low battery anxiety are crucial, critical aspects in improving the QoE of video streaming service. Which is one key feature of our APVS, the video streaming capacity at the edge. For the video chance request by the device and, and to be transformed at the edge during the time slot T, i.e. D and T, the computing resources that the video transforming needs is estimated by G, G, D and T, where G dot is function reflects the server's computing resources needed for video transforming. Similarly, the storage resources that the video transforming consumes can be estimated by HDT, where H is a function for storage space measuring during video transforming. For the H server attached to VC, it usually has quite limita limited com computing and storage resources. For example, Nokia or Nokia or inspiring H server, Nokia or 14 and 13, 13 3. We denoted the extra computing and the storage resources available at the H server to perform video streaming, video transforming by C and S, respectively. Then, then we have the following two capacity constraints. Joint optimization for energy saving and JIT reduction. Given the H server capacity constraints for each time slot, our targets are 
first, minimize the display energy consumption of all the all the mobile devices during video playback, and and two, to minimize the anxiety degree of all users simultaneously. The problem can be formulated as minimum sigma sigma n to n sigma k equal one to k m pi n m k plus lambda pi e n m k. Where lambda is lambda is regulation parameter that balances the two targets. Km is a constraint representing the total number of chunks processed by the video streaming server is one time one time slow slow for arbitrary video m. Remarks about lambda in practice of LPVS, the regulation parameter lambda should be determined or regulated by the video streaming service providers placed on on their own policies and specific service level agreement SLA with the customers with we 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 will show show this parameter can affect the result ie for example the energy saving and anxiety reduction in solution methodology the difficulties in it is non literal is uh, to solve the joint optimization problem given by A, mainly due to the three difficulties. Difficulty one, the device energy status ENMK should be predict predicted after playing each video chunks during the whole time slot. For constraint three, four, and five, fifths and the uh, objective function. For instance, with the, the effect of K, the energy status update with five needs to be performed chance by chance. The constraint and the objective function hence twist together, making the optimization problem hard to solve. Difficult to, to the problem generally generally belongs to the integer programming as the XN, XNT is binary. While whether it is it is linear or nonlinear so depend on the function of pi. For example the anxiety curve in the objection of 8A Referring to the extracted anxiety curve in figure 2, the function is obviously nonlinear and thus the problem we are facing belongs to the nonlinear integer programming which is normally interactive. Difficulty 3. Different devices may, may have different power reduction ratio Rn, whose value is known in advance. As we have mentioned, it is it's not fixed value and vary over different transformed videos. Hence, it, it causes a circular argument to solve the problem. We need the value of Rn as one of the inputs. On the other hand, we have made no information about the value of Rn be before the problem is solved. We tackle the above three difficulties with information compacting. Second, two-phase heuristic and the third, Bayesian inference, respectively. Information compacting. We find the both constraint and the object can be compacted in a way that k is margin marginalized and uh, second, the intermediate energy status ENMK is eliminated. After information compacting, we can transform the problem into an, a neater form that renders an easy solution. Information compacting for constraint. First, we perform information compacting on constraint of 4 and 5 fifths, as only these two constraints are related to ENMK. We first summarize over K for the inequality of constraint 4. Sigma K equal 1, K equal KM, ENMK, X, N, R, N, K equal 1, KM, K, N, K. Using fifths, we rewrite the left hand, left hand side of the 9 as k equal 1 to sigma k equal 1 to k equal e n m k. Replacing the left hand side of the 9 with the 10th, so we have k m e n m 1 minus k equal 1 sigma k m k m minus k pi n m k. In constraint 11 for given values for of decision variables x n 1 to n n. All the other parameters are easy to calculate. Km, the total number of video chunks delivered with 
delivered within one time slot, which is no constraint for each individual's video. ENM1, the initial energy status of each device at the beginning of each time slot, which is reported at the scheduling point by each device. PNMK, the power rate of the device playing each chunk without transforming, which is known beforehand with existing power models. Pi NMK, the power rate of the device playing each chunk under the given value of decision variables Xn, which can be computed with knowledge of PNMK, refer to the efficient in 3. Rn, the power reduction ratio of each device after video transforming, which can be estimated and updated via Bayesian approaches, refer, refer to the details in VD. Information compacting in objective. Next, next, we perform information compacting for objective functions to avoid computation of intermediate energy status, ENMK. With FIBS, we can derive, derive the relationship between a device's predicting energy status after playing a video chunk and its initially, initial energy status, ENMK. Thus, the object to function 8a can be rewritten, rewritten as sigma n equal 1 and k equal 1 sigma km, in which all elements are either readily available or can be easily computed with the given decision variable of xn. We, we when applying the compact constraint 11 to replace original constraint to force and fifths and the, and the transformed for objective 13th to replace the original objectives, 8a. It is worth mentioning that the compacting form of the problem is equivalent, equivalent to the original problem, 8, as information compacting comes from 8, 9, 9, and 12, which only involves quantities, qualities. To phase heuristic for just joint optimization, to solve the nonlinear integer problem, we develop a two-phase heuristic method. Phase 1, we solve the problem optimization problem without considering the nonlinear function pi the above the problem belongs to the to lin linear integer programming L ILP. Furthermore, with the compare compacting form, it can be directly fed into the off the shelf ILP servers such as Cplex, uh, Groovy, or CVX. By solving the problem, we actually obtain the subset uh, say with the number of n of the mobile device for video transforming, with which the energy consumption is minimized. Phase 2. To further cope with the user's anxiety, we sort the mobile device by the energy status, with which the anxiety degrees of the mobile users are next. Then, the, then we try to swap the selected nth device in phase 1 with the first n to n, n minus n prime devices whose one's owners have the largest anxiety degrees. The swapping is successful only when the objective value computed with 13th is reduced. The nonlinear function pi could use, use, use any theoretical anxiety energy model known, the, known to the best of our knowledge over an empirical function such as introduced in 3. Note the computation complexities of both phase 1 and phase 2 are much lower than solving the original nonlinear problem. For VC including 1000 devices, our implementation on, on a row and machine can find the optimal solution in phase 1 in 5 seconds using the off the shelf IRP server and can finish the swapping process within first minutes. Considering the scheduling time length in 5 minutes in the implementation, the computing overhead of LPVS is acceptable under one slot ahead scheduling work mode. Determine RN with the Bayesian inference. When playing a transfer video, mobile devices of different specifications, LCD or OLED sizing, etc., may have different power reduction ratio RN. Nevertheless, before a transformed video play played, on a device Rn, the value of Rn is unknown. In other words, a scheduling point, we actually do not know the value of the Rn for the following time slot, since the video chunks have not been played yet. 
although we cannot know, we cannot know the value of Rn for the current time slot t, t upper 1. Fortunately, we do have information of the previous time slot t minus 1 and can, can get the value of the Rn at the end of the previous time slot. This inspires us to update the value of the Rn with the obtained information observation from previous time slots. Such as an idea can be naturally implemented by, with Bayesian inference by treating Rn as the random variable at the first at the beginning of the first time slot. At the beginning of the first time slot, we initialize the probability distribution function PDF of power reduction ratio with the Gaussian distribution, where micro and sigma sigma square represent the represent the means of various of the Gaussian distribution respectively. Micro can be initialized by micro mu to per representing the power of the representing the power of the upper bound of power reduction ratio representatively refer to refer to table one as a one of initialized sigma two sigma square we can choose a relatively big value due to the lack of confidence confidence about the constraint constraint are an example implementation at the end of the time slot t with observation of power reduction when playing transform transform the video in time slot t denoted we update the pdf rn for the next time slot posterior bayesian rules Where PRN is the period of RN used in the time slot T, PRN is the likelihood of the ob observation under the RN, PN is the marginal distribution, lambda N. Being of the time slot T1, with the above posterior of RN, we compute the expect expected value of expectations. and apply the obtained value of for video transforming scheduling for example ep for the time slot t plus one note that rn is is assumed to following the gaussian distribution the likelihood of period pair in the in 17th conjugate 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 in this way the update rn can be can be computed precisely without any approximation implementation real world video streaming traces we target the video streaming services as it becomes extremely popular in recent years. It is reported by Twitch, a popular live video video streaming platform that in 20, 2017 only 355 billion minutes of a live stream were watched and more than 2 million streamers had broadcast channels on the platform. 37. We then use a data set from Twitch uh, as input request for our evaluations. The data set consists of traces from thousands of live streaming channels 2014 with a sample intervals of 5 minutes. It includes the details information such as the number of viewers in each channel, byte rate, byte rate of, the, of each channel, and the duration of live channel. We filter the data and only keep the live channels and let that last for no more than 10 hours, which results 1,566 live channels and uh, 4,471 live video sessions. The history of the video session duration is given in Figure 5, FBS emulation and setups. The, to emulation, the whole process of FBS and validate its effectiveness. We develop an emulator, emulator with building blocks shown in Figure 6. The major procedure includes information gathering, request scheduling, and video transforming. Information gathering, rationale. At each scheduling point, FBS along with their video chunks request the user's mobile devices report the displaced information. 
For example, size and resolution, as well as the energy status to the LPV scheduler. Meanwhile, the video information, for example, whether it cash and currently available, is also collected from the from either CDN, POP, and HBO streaming servers. In addition, as introduced in 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 four slash B, the power rates of the request video chunks are also estimated as a server side, aided by existing power models and the profit profiling techniques for LCD and OLED respectively. Setup the scheduling the framework LPVS emulator and is major building blocks. Set up the scheduling period. The, for example, length of the time slots LPVS is set to five minutes, which is consistent with the sampling intervals of Twitch dataset, a group of viewers in each channels. Twitch are selected and form virtual cluster we see in our context. Some needed information to drive LPVS and can be obtained from the dataset. For example, the number of live channels, videos, the number of chunks in the each time slot, and the resolution of request videos. For other information, they cannot be run from dataset. For example, the power rate of live video can be speci specifications of displays. We assign values for each for each them each of them randomly choosing from available display resolution under the supported bio rate. As the energy status of the energy mobile devices, it is also not, it is not constrained in the data set. So we randomly assign the value following Gaussian distribution at the beginning of emulation. Request schedule, national, at the server side with the gathering information of user request, the entity defined by one, display the specification input of the resource consumption functions, g dot and h dot in for that for slash the energy status ENMM and video metadata for example byte rate bit rate and power rate the PNM LPVS scheduler performs the video request scheduling task specifically by for following the solution methodological methodology interest in five the scheduler is able to select the optimal subset of, of the of the request video for transforming under the constraint, the edges of edge server capacity, the edge server capacity. This returns a scheduling strategy that re then results the maximum display energy saving and the low battery anxiety reduction simultaneously. Set up the LPV scheduler works under the one slot ahead scheduling mode, i.e., for example, during current slot, LPVS make the decision from for on for the incoming request in the next time slot, then the scheduling point of the next time slot, the obtaining decision will be executed. With each selected videos is sent to encoders. Furthermore, we experiment on on different values of lambda to validate the effectiveness of LPVS WRT balancing the power saving and anxiety reduction. Video transforming rationale. As shown in Figure 6, all the request videos will go through the encoder component at the server side. Within the video encoder, the select videos chunks by the scheduler will be transformed using the techniques introduced in 2.b. And meanwhile, the meanwhile, the unselected videos by bypass the transforming functions. After the video transforming, the power saving ratio Rn can, can be updated the following our strategy. Set up the amount of video that can be transformed simultaneously depends on the capacity of the edge streaming servers. Referring to commercial edge server model from Nokia, Wireframe Open Edge Server 14 and the resource resource can that on one edge server can process process the video streaming including transforming for up to 100 mobile devices simultaneously. Moreover, at the beginning of the time slot, we can reset the period distribution of RN by Gaussian distribution with view 0 0.13 plus 0 0.14 per 2 0 0.31 refer to 
refer to the average upper and lower bound given in table 1 and sigma 12. Performance evaluation. In this section, we evaluate the performance of LPVS under the sufficient, under sufficient and insufficient edge capacity, respectively. Furthermore, we also investigate the impact of LPVS on the time, time per viewer. For example, the time of the individual viewers is spending on watch videos, and list the overhead LPVS and this overhead of LPVS evaluated WRT, the running time of, for optimal scheduling, LPVS with sufficient edge resources. We, we first analyze the performance of LPVS under sufficient edge resource condition. As mentioned in our implement implementations, we choose the edge server with capacity supporting up to 100 mobile users, video transforming simultaneously. Those will look into performance LPVS for those bases with no more than 100 mobile users, with a group size ranging from the 150 to 100 specifically. Energy saving of a mobile device. The result on energy saving can be found in Figure 7, where the bar chart in blue color shows the percentage of energy saving after applying LPVS. The energy average energy saving ratio of different testing groups certified that 20% with the maximum energy saving ratio of 37 that 13% does it can be concluded that LPVS can save large large portion of energy of user mobile device anxiety reduction of mobile users the result on the users anxiety and elimination can also be found in figure 7 with the orange line chart at the end of at the right y-axis, specifically the percentage of user anxiety reduction after applying LPVS are given. Under different user group size, the average anxiety reduction ratio different test group is 6.82%, group is with the maximum anxiety reduction ratio 7.36%. We can see that with LPVS, the mobile user's anxiety can be elevated. While the effect is not significant as the of energy saving, this is mainly caused by the experimental setup that the energy status follow, follows a Gaussian distribution. We reach the majority with uh, with an energy energy status around the 50%, where the anxiety curve is relatively flat. Refer to Figure 2. Nevertheless, as we as will be shown in the impact of LPVS on the low battery users is significant. LPVS with limited edge resources. We then look into the codes where the edge capacity is not enough. For example, the computing and, and the storage resources are insufficient to provide LPVS to all users, but a selective subset. Specifically, we investigate the performance of LPVS in those base bases with user group size ranging from 100 to 500. In addition, in addition, since only a subset of users can be served with the LPVS, the regularization param parameter lambda takes effect in balancing the energy saving and anxiety reductions. Energy saving of mobile devices. The energy saving ratio of multiple user groups are shown in Figure 8a under different settings of lambda. We can see that the energy saving ratio decreases with the increasing number of mobile users as the portion of users that can advantage so LPVS becomes smaller. In addition with the increase of the lambda, the weight for energy saving in the objective of problem A becomes smaller, thus leading to decrease of energy saving ratio in VC group. Anxiety reduction of mobile users. The anxiety reduction ratio of mobile users under the different voice groups illustrated in Figure 8 a, a B, based on the result, the anxiety reduction ratio decreases with increases in user group size, which causes an insufficient edge capacity. Furthermore, with the increase of the lambda, with the eight of the anxiety reduction in the object function becomes larger, thus resulting in increase, increased anxiety reduction for each voice groups. It is also worth mentioning that we only illustrate the effect of lambda in balancing the energy saving and anxiety reduction. How to set the value of lambda in practice determined by the LPVS provider based on specific policies and 
SLAs, which beyond the sp scope of this work, impact of LPVS Rubella users. We have observed that the overall percentage anxiety reduction with LPVS not not that obvious at or as the in, in energy saving when the major majority of users will have a relatively sufficient right battery life. Nevertheless, when the shift our, our focus to the users who have a low battery status, the impact on LPVS is significant. To test the impact, we calculate the material of time per viewer TV, TPV for low battery users. For example, the time duration of individual users or video watching under sufficient sufficient edge capacity conditions. Conditions. The TP, TPV metric is inferred from on our survey questions. Question. At, at what battery level is percentage from 1% to 100%? Will you give a watching a video, video you are interested in on your mobile phone? For each voice group we have tested, we collected data on those users who are selected for user transforming, served by LPVS with energy status 0.40%, so called low battery users. At the starting of LPVS, then the, we calculate the value of TPV, TPV for each low battery users. user. The comparison of TPV values without applying LPVS are also computed for these low battery users. The resulting are illustrated in Figure 9 for the cases with and without applying LPVS respectively. From, from the figure, we can find that without LPVS, the average value of L TPV is 42.3 minutes, we, while with LPVS, the average TPV value increases to 58.7 minutes. This means that LPVS brings is an extra TPV of the 16.4 minutes which corresponding 38.8% of the watching time duration of the low battery users, overhead of LPVS and impact on other QoS metrics, two -way metrics. We, print, we treat LPVS, LPVS as, the, as a value-adding value service upon the combination video streaming and focus on evaluate, evaluating the overhead LPVS WRT it is timing. Learning time. This is necessary. Unnecessary then, when we adopt the one slot ahead working mode. If the scheduling cannot be finished in one one time slot, it will affect the conventional video streaming service and the may degrade other QoE metrics. For example, increasing the video, increasing video freezing time and frequency. The average learning time LPVS resulting from our emulation is illustrated in Figure 10. When performing optimal scheduling under different VC groups group size, we can observe that first, with the increase of user group size, for example, number of mobile devices, the running time on LPVS increases accordingly. Second, the increasing trend approximately linear indicating the low time complexity of our heuristic method given in VC. Under such a linear increase trend, the maximum, maximum number of users' devices that our LPVS scheduler can handle is over 5,000 within the scheduling time stretch of 5 minutes. Figure 10. Running time LPVS scheduler with increasing VC group size. Fitting the linear regression function is y equal 0 0.555 minus 0 0.324 with the R square value R square equal 0 0.999. Note that we did not consider overhead video content transfer for this analysis, as it is actually completed in the conventional video enco encoding phase. Refer to details of video transformation. We IP. Therefore, the overhead joint optimization for energy reduction and anxiety elimination in LPVS can be controlled following the one slot ahead working mode, thus making no impact on other QoE metrics, delay and jitter, video streaming in practice. The per perceptual impact of 
video transform ha has been well addressed, for example, and beyond the scope of our work. Conclusion, we propose a novel solution for lower-power video streaming service, LPVS, to save the ever-increasing ever display energy consumption of mobile devices and elevate mobile users, low battery anxiety. In specific, we explicitly depicted the scenario where LPVS could apply and model the energy saving and anxiety reduction the, at the energy by joint optimization problem. Then we analyze the difficulties in, in solving the problem. We developed the two-phase heuristic method accordingly, aided by information compacting and Bayesian inference. To be, help build, build LPVS, we conducted an, on, an online survey on low battery anxiety and collected data from 2032 mobile users, which were used to extract quantitative relationship between the anxiety degree and the battery status with an LPVS emulator and a real Twitch dataset. We investigate the benefit of LPVS solution, energy savings, energy savings and anxiety reduction. The result demonstrates that LPVS can save the overall mobile users' battery lives up to 37% and prolong the rural battery users' video watching time by 39%.